Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name is Alicia. If you're new here, I'm a homeschool mom of three small children. And uh, today I'm gonna to take you along with me on a project that I have had in the back of my mind for a really long time. I just haven't gotten around to it. But the other day I was at the Dollar Tree picking up some things and then I remembered that I needed to organize underneath my kitchen sink because for so long it the whole system that i had under there when we first moved in uh quickly outdated um we've lived in this house about four years now and so um when we first moved in i had one system that worked really well so now it's kind of a mess and it's really getting on my nerves and i want it to look nice um, and be a lot more functional than it really is because everything is just kind of um, thrown in there right now Oh, but anyway, let me finish what I was saying So I went to the Dollar Tree for some other things and ended up looking at the um, The organization section which if you don't know Dollar Tree has a really great organization basket uh, I picked up these three. I just picked up three um, I picked up two Dollar Tree waste baskets and these longer um, little organizers, these locker uh, locker style bins um, are the three that I picked up because those should be all that we really need to organize. Now I'm gonna show you my cabinet and then I'm gonna show you how I organized it. So this is the underneath of our cabinet. So I took the old dish rack that was under here and I put it in the sink um, with the goal of keeping dishes off the sink, but that didn't work. So uh, we just put it down here and I tried to make an organization system, but as you can see, it didn't really work out because there's just stuff everywhere. Um, I like, that's an old pot. Um, I like to keep it around to boil old rags uh, for this that start smelling funny. And so I like to boil the rags, that way I can get all the, the germs and stuff off of it. But yeah, we just have all this stuff. I keep our towels in there, <laughs> our dish water, dish claws in there this thing is just a mess so my goal is to get this cleaned up organize it and have a more efficient system
All right, are you ready for the final reveal? Ta-da! I mean, what a difference. Wow. So, starting from left to right, one of the secrets to good organization is putting the stuff that you use the least in the back, which is um, this giant thing, Adreno. Um, we don't use that that often. And then um, I really like putting stuff in little bins that slide in and out. And this one actually fits perfectly between um, the pipe and here. And here I just put in, um, there's some barkeeper's friends, some Lysol oven cleaner. Um, I think this is hydrogen peroxide. Most of this is stuff. Um, that I got during the pandemic. And then this is just a random bottle of um, water mixed with, I think, dish soap and floor cleaner, if I didn't say that already. Um, I usually keep vinegar water in here for just general cleaning. Um, and we'll keep the soap here. These are things that we use most often, so we'll just keep these here. Just a little thing of, um, you know, cleaning utensils for the stove, drainer, drain, a drain clogger. I don't know what that's called. And then some scrub brushes. Um, that is for safety. I got some carpet cleaner back there. I use those when I potty train just in case they have accidents. Um, some extra SOS pads. I don't, whoops, sorry, bad light. I don't know what that little thing is back there. And then that's a pan I use again for, um, boiling rags, um, some extra, some extra vases. And that is the tray for the dish rack that I have in the um, sink right now. Keeping it just in case we change our minds. And then this is definitely a, ni a lot more, this is definitely a nicer way to keep our towels. So, and wash rags. So yeah, what a difference that makes. It looks so much nicer under here. So much nicer, so much easier to use. Steven, come here. What do you think? It was nice. <laughs> then all that stuff's out of the way. I know. Nothing falls over when you put it. I put the Drano in the back. There's a bunch of cleaners here. The dish. Why is there a Korean bowl in the back? A what? There's a Korean bowl in the back. No, that's the, oh, that's like your, that's the boiling pan. Yep. So it took me less than 10 minutes. Uh, the video is a little bit longer because I was talking, but... Uh, yeah, it took me less than 10 minutes to do and a uh, simple, few simple steps. Uh, empty everything out, wipe it down, um, find or find systems that work for you. Put stuff you use less often in the back. Um, try if you can put stuff in a little bin that you can move in and out. It's a lot easier. And um, the stuff you use more often in the front. It's just a lot easier that way, more efficient. I like systems for small or for any kind of organization space. It just makes it easier for everyone. And the more organized it is, the more easy it is to use and the more likely you are to maintain it. So anyway, that is my short video. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you have a good night. Good night. <laughs>